Uh, going to head seven, up back over to Beetleweight six, Action Cage 2, five, the Immortal Crixus versus Caldera. Or Caldera! Caldera! Uh, Robots yeah. fight. Now, Caldera has already uh, qualified for the December finals. We've got Santana starts here with the Immortal Crixus. And uh, the Immortal Crixus defeated Ooh. me earlier today. <laughs> and uh, we're going to see here if uh, that weapon reliability wow. is going to be the same. Wow, big hit from oh, the Immortal wow. Crixus. We see some plywood that is... Uh... Oh, there's dust kicking up everywhere in there. I love it. Oh, big oh. hits there. And Caldera is, uh, is just spinning there in the corner. Caldera Ooh. does not turn off its weapon, Chris. Oh, wow. my goodness. We're seeing oh. great drive, great weapons here. We have so much sawdust in the box. Oh! 60 oh. seconds have elapsed here. We've got two minutes to go. Big hits here in the Beetleweights. Seeing part of that armor stripped away on the Immortal Crixus. Yeah, that that uh, that wheel is now vulnerable to Caldera. But we've seen a lot of weapon-to-weapon -weapon exchanges so far. Caldera is not afraid to uh, to smash headfirst into its opponent. You gotta have a lot of faith in, in some kind of uh, horizontal bar versus a, uh, a spinner uh, like that kind of um, drum that you see on the Immortal Crixus. It does look like the right side of the drive on the Immortal Crixus is locked up. Oh, oh my gosh, there we oh. go. One of the wheels from the Immortal Crixus is gone. Santana Starks is now very slowly, and you can see he's dragging that drum on the floor, making that huge wow. arc in the plywood. 50 seconds left in this fight. <laughs> Leave our sponsors alone. <laughs> and now that all that Caldera needs to do is stay alive. We have seen great drive, great weapon. Uh, you know, reliability from Caldera today. But Santana refuses to give up. Down a wheel and still attacking. I love this warrior spirit. 15 seconds left. This one will go to the judges. Incredibly punishing, incredibly destructive, incredibly entertaining, Chris. Yeah. Four, three, oh! Wow. One, two, one. That's the match. Everyone turn off your weapons. Oh. Wow. One last hit. Nope, nope, nope. It's over. Uh, take it there easy. There we go. Take it easy. All right. Bloodthirsty. This one will go to the judges. What a great match. That was fun. That was really fun to watch. All right, that one was one for the highlight reel. I would love to start with you, Jack. Your thoughts on this fight, the Immortal Crixus versus, I'm blanking, the Immortal Crixus Cal Caldera. versus Caldera. Caldera, your, your thoughts, Jack. Uh, yeah, first of all, like, props to the Immortal Crixus for keeping on going through that, even though there was not really much coming back from it. And, you know, I kind of have to give the vote to Caldera. And also, in regards to the last fight, I would like to formally challenge the builders of Jack to some kind of contest for the right to be named as such. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. All right, we've got one vote for Caldera. Don, your thoughts on this fight? Uh, great match. Uh, but once the Mora lost a wheel, it's kind of downhill from there. Um, so, yeah, Caldera. All right, we've got two votes for Caldera. Diana, take us home. I'm also going to vote for Caldera. All right, we've got three votes for Caldera, which advances with the unanimous judge's decision. Kyle, how was lunch? It was delicious. I had Thai.